I'm Bob Brunkel. I'm a physicist here at Pacific Northwest National Lab. We put on a, a two-week summer school for primarily graduate students, but also advanced undergraduate students, and the topic was uh, radiation detection as it applies to nuclear security. We brought in guest lecturers that are really world experts in specific areas to talk about the actual work that they performed in the field. And then we have a whole series of activities that give students a, really an understanding of some of the systems that we use uh, and modeling activities just to understand some of the challenges that we face. We took the students into the shallow underground laboratory. This is a laboratory located underground that allows us to shield our radiation detectors from cosmogenic radiation coming in from the atmosphere. It is also a clean room inside the laboratory, so the students uh, put on protective equipment that uh, kept the dust and radioactivity on their shoes and in their clothing outside of the laboratory. The students toured the test track, which is a place where we test uh, radiation portal monitors, either portal monitors that have been deployed or portal monitors that may be deployed in the future that are on the cutting edge of research and development. They actually set these systems up to try to detect nuclear material. Out at the Hammer facility, uh, the students engaged in activities and, and exercises where they would actually measure gamma ray and neutron emissions from nuclear material that we would want to interdict, for example, at foreign border crossings. This included plutonium, highly enriched uranium, uh, low enriched uranium, as well as common nuisance sources that might be in the stream of commerce. So the goal of the school is to really give students an understanding of how we use radiation detectors in national security missions and what it actually means to deploy those detectors in terms of the operational constraints that people face when they actually use them in the field. We really found that the main value coming from this that couldn't be achieved really anywhere else is to have that understanding of what is the work we actually do here at Pacific Northwest National Laboratory and how does that work apply to nuclear security.